we're gonna go ahead and continue reading there's a lot of beautiful information here meditations for soul realization by master joa koksui and we're on page 16 activating the heart center before activating the crown center intuitive intelligence and mental intelligence the crown chakra is the intuitive center what is intuition what is the difference between intuitive intelligence and mental intelligence the difference is similar to a man who can see and a man who is blind if a blind person wants to know an elephant he has to touch it for quite some time to gather data and process them in order to have an idea of the shape of an elephant a person who has eyes to see will simply open his eyes and say that is an elephant and will know exactly what an elephant looks like intuitive intelligence is just like opening eyes your eyes and saying i know what that is mental intelligence requires study and the use of use of logic through inductive and deductive reasoning unless your crown center is activated you will not experience soul realization or divine union with your higher soul hmm. everyone has the capability Many scientific discoveries were made through intuitive intelligence. Ideas simply flash in the minds of some scientists. After that, they use mental intelligence to validate whether the ideas are correct or not. Many good businessmen have intuit intuitive intelligence. They look at certain transactions and they go straight to the point. The prolonged practice of meditation on twin hearts for peace and illumination gives a person partially the ability to see and penetrate very quickly. People with intuitive intelligence will become very superior. And this is an image of the heart and the crown chakras of an ordinary person. So he is saying they are normal, aka small, as compared to an enlightened person who will have a large, large, expansive chakra and energy field. Oh, the heart and crown chakras of regular meditator using meditation on twin hearts for peace and illumination. See, everything is quite expanded. So, effect of meditation on twin hearts for peace and illumination on the crown center. The crown center is normally flat, but it bulges out when it is activated. Have you not come across a yogi who seems to have a bump on top of his head when you look at him from a distance? I will have to look. This means that the crown center of the person is partially activated. When the spiritual practitioner meditates further, the crown center opens like a lotus flower to receive spiritual energy that is distributed to other parts of the body. Sometimes one may see a lotus or a sunflower or crown on top of the head of a person who has been meditating for a long time. That makes sense because if the energy is always stuck around you, it's going to create denseness. So kind of makes sense. The crown worn by kings and queens is but a poor replica or symbol of an indescribable resplendent crown center of a spiritually developed person. Since the crown center is revolving, some clairvoyants may see a golden flame of light on top of the head of the meditator. In the Christian tradition, this is symbolized by the mitre worn by the Pope, cardinals, and bishops. There's also but a golden halo around the head. Saints of all religions, whether Christian, Buddhist, Taoist, or others, have halos around their heads. What does the halo mean? The crown center, or the center of divine love, is highly activated. Since there are different degrees of spiritual development, the size and brightness of the halo vary. Many saints put up schools and hospitals in order to improve the lives of people. This is a manifestation of loving kindness or divine love. How long will it take to activate the heart and crown chakras? Using an ordinary method like the practice of mantra or devotion may take 10 to 30 years or longer. Using meditation on twin hearts may take a year or less. This technique was used by advanced yogis in ancient times in different parts of the world. It was reserved for senior disciples only. Now this meditation is being revealed to the public. Meditation on twin hearts rapidly activates the heart and crown centers, which is necessary to achieve union with the higher soul. Therefore, is it advisable to practice meditation on twin hearts 
daily. This meditation is simple but very powerful. How do you do this meditation? It will be covered later on in this book. Next up, the spiritual cord. 